Circus Trip is a game about a circus that has a hidden dark layer. In this video today, we'll be exploring the themes, the story and the endings of the game. Spoilers alert for the video, watch at your caution. There has been a circus attraction in the park that has been going for a few years now, many kids have been lost and the circus shows audiences empty. A few years go by before they were finally shut down. A group of kids and a guidance counselor goes camping in a small campsite, as the night quickly goes sour with the tents burning down and the bus engine failing. They decided to take shelter at the circus, but first, they have to take quite a dangerous route there. Crossing over the bear traps, there is a minor change to the ending and the following obstacle, depending on whether or not you step on the bear traps. For example, if you do step on the bar traps, you will have to escape the wolves for the next two obstacles and a ranger will be found dead. However, if you don't step on the bar traps, the ranger would be alive and no wolves would chase you. No matter the outcome, the survivors will make their way to the circus. The host of the current circus show is Giggles, and weirdly, the circus has almost no audience apart from the guidance counselor and the kids. The show opens with a clown in the cannon, intending to launch at the audience, but the cannon exploded upon itself, killing the clown. It's not clear if this is meant to happen or not, due to the ambiguous nature of the current act and what's to follow. The next act contains Lala the Jester carrying three monkeys on a tricycle on a rope. Now you can probably guess what's going to happen next. The rope snapped dropping her and the monkey onto the circus circle, but she's not dead, she appears later as a burglar, alive and well. Giggles decides to call the kids over, all the kids except the bacon kid, to escape a variety of deadly obstacles. After the final obstacle, the circus lights go out and everyone wakes up on a riverside. The kids witness the gruesome murder of the guidance counselor before passing out and waking up in cages. Giggles, who has now turned into a monstrous version of himself named the Giggler, taunted the kids before walking off, leaving them with the snoozing guard. They all escaped, and knocked the guard out, but someone stopped them, that was a hostage. He begged them to either save him or mercy kill him, but the kids decided to rescue him. The hostage was revealed to be an ex-park ranger, who knows his way around the circus. This proved to be helpful for the kids as they take cover in his home, which is now a crime scene. The park ranger contacted the police department, as they are reassured that the SWAT team will be coming to them soon. They quickly barricaded the doors, as the windows break, revealing the clowns and the jesters. The giggler reveals himself, as he locks the kids up and knocked the park ranger out, he revealed that he has been taking care of the house and making the crime scene abandoned, implying that he murdered the investigators and the polices. The ranger attacked the giggler, and Bacon Kid unlocked everyone's chains as they all ran to the safe heavens, which is a basement. The basement was revealed to be the giggler's hideout, as he hides all the evidence there. The giggler knocked on the door causing them to immediately rush to the open door, crossing over the pipes. Now there's two endings you can achieve at this stage. The first, and sad ending, which is achieved by dying during and after this stage, but not reviving or having the Infinity Lives game pass. After which, Giggles caught you but, you begged for mercy. Giggles spared you, but at a cost, you're the newest trainee in the deadly crew. Anyways, if you got past the pipes, you're almost there, to the happy ending. You arrived out of the bunker with the survivors, as you arrived at the cabin leading to the exits, it's filled with weapons. It's boss fight time. Now, remember the bear traps stage? Okay, if you didn't step on the bear traps, the ranger will come to pump that freak full of lead but will get knocked out by a sandbag. If he didn't come, due to being eaten by wolves, whom attention you have attracted by stepping on the bear traps, shame on you, you would have a harder time beating Giggles and his crew. After a few minutes of fending the monsters off, the SWAT team will arrive, in which you are required to run into the van. Hooray, the happy ending is unlocked, Giggles Circus got shut down, the kids have a funeral for the tour guide and the news report detailing his terrorist attacks on schools. 
Overall, the game is pretty refreshing to the genre, with the players not immediately being rushed to the circus. It has some slow story building, and that is what's great. As always, I hope you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe if you do enjoy it. Wish all the hashtags, likes and tweets will find a way to get lost. Yeah, and when I pull up to the scene, I wonder what the hell is the cause.